The owner did a clinic at my high school in my sophomore year. And I was kind of like, yo, like, you travel the world teaching basketball? And so literally since sophomore year of high school, I, like, I knew exactly what I wanted to do. Then I started training and then the day of my graduation party um, in high school, he texted me and was like, hey, you want to be one of my skills coaches? Yeah, I bet. This is a very little production. Yeah. You know, and, it's, and there's not a whole lot that goes on for them. And I try to push it on coaches, and that's why I think we didn't get as many people signed up because I pushed it on coaches to say, hey, look, what I went about it was this is an opportunity for your girls to get better. I think yeah. the training piece of what a lot of kids miss, yeah. they want to get it all in practice. And it's bigger than that. Yeah. And most coaches probably didn't push it out to their kids because they don't, they, don't, they don't want their kids training or they don't see value in sitting with somebody else to train. Yeah, it's such. It's, it's important. It's just like, because if you don't do it, the other kid's doing it. Right. They don't, they don't, I don't realize that the, what the high level kids are doing. They don't understand why Jacob's so good. Yeah. They don't. People don't get it. They think it's because it just happens. Or, yeah, like those are like the two guys that, that like, hey, let's get in the gym. They're like, in the gym. At 9 o'clock. Like, it's not easy. No. You it's know not what I mean? It's just they, like, can, they can be doing other things. Yeah. And that's what I think, that's what they don't get it. That's what I said. I told them, I was trying to push it. They gotta get more than just looking at your practices. Yeah. You know? Because at your practices, you're worried about what do we see as a team last stuff. weekend? Yeah. What do we need to do this weekend? You know what I mean? And you can't really get everybody individually kind of focused on what you I mean, you can try, but I mean, especially in our world where you only have two hours, you know, three yeah, hours a week. They got like, a day. So you know, you have back. like the roles <laughs> and you're, yeah. Right. right. So what I need is this NES3. Sprint down to the baseline. Don't dribble and put your ball down up against the wall, then spread it. Right. Got it? Five seconds, go. So when I go sweet, you're gonna go. Okay. When I say jab, all you're gonna do, or if I'm you guys, I say jab, you're just gonna go boom. And then right back here, keep it dribble. Does that make sense? Then I'm gonna say jab again, boom. Right back here, keep it dribble. Jab, boom. Right back here, keep it dribble. Minute and a half, two, three. Don't touch the floor or the ball. You just want to zoom in like, can you like edit these? Shut up. Can you move in a second? Yeah, hello. She's amazing. I wouldn't go that far. Don't pop her up in the head yet. We have three hours, okay, um, and we're gonna go pretty hard for the three hours. A lot of it, though, um, it's gonna be hard physically, but a lot of it's gonna be mental, mental stuff and thinking about the game and, and stuff like that. I won't teach effort. Um, if I feel like I have to teach effort, I'll just say, "See you later. We'll refund your money, and then we'll move on." Fair enough. Okay, just go as hard as you can. If you guys get tired, we'll get drinks. Um, this is a boot camp. Yeah, it's a basketball camp. We're supposed to get better, so I'm not gonna run you guys into the ground. Go as hard as you can. When you get tired, and I see you know we're kind of declining. We'll get a drink. We'll come back, and we'll just keep going.
finish right there. Watch out, the finish, perfect. yesterday I'll tell you guys the same thing when we get out of here. <coughs> continue to do the extra stuff. Okay, continue to do the extra stuff. And what I mean is this. Pretty much everyone plays on a team, correct? Pretty much everyone goes to practice, correct? When you get in high school, listen, when you get in high school, you're gonna go to weights. You're gonna have practices, you're gonna have games, like you're gonna have tournaments on the weekend. And everyone's gonna do that stuff. Okay, stuff like this not everyone does. Okay, and I was talking about with me, like with anyone, like the extra stuff is what separates. That makes sense? You guys all have to have a separator. So like, you gotta be doing stuff that other people aren't. Let's get a break then. Get up, get up, get up. Hard work on three as loud as we can. Hard work? Hard work on three as loud as we can. You've got to break down. I got it. Hard work on three! What? Feel out there today. I feel tired, I feel hungry. Yeah. Yeah. It went by a lot faster than I. No, dude, yeah, when you know. like the that's how it is. Like if you want to do the summer, like you'll notice like you start to enjoy like if you come to summer, you'll really enjoy like the high school games. Yeah. Because yeah. you start to like you're close enough in age exactly. that you can kind of like be like boys, you know what exactly. I mean? Yeah, and everyone's you're basically more serious. About yeah, it. and you're basically an older brother. Yeah, yeah. Because that's like what I want to separate. That's why I'm starting to get so many clients is like yeah. the relationships. You know what I mean? Right, right. I mean that's what it all. It's that's all what about. everything's about. Okay. So it's like you know they'll text me after a game or like the best is like when they text me like just to be like yo what's up bro how you how you doing? You yeah, know what I mean? Yeah. All right, bro, like I'm struggling with XYZ that has literally zero to do right. with basketball. Exactly, but y'all built that relationship. Yeah, it's so. all about the relationship. Because right? yeah. it's about trust. Exactly. And the parents enjoy it too, because obviously it's a business and, you know, it's, I'm not doing this for free. Right. And they understand that it's more than the paycheck they give me at the end of the session. Yeah, yeah. You yeah. know what I mean? Right. Yeah, like I mean, my like biggest, the, when you were leaving, everyone was thanking you. Yeah, and like my biggest thing is like I know what's going on with them outside of basketball. Uh -huh. You know what I mean? Like those guys are a little bit different because it was a one-time deal. Mm -hmm. But the people that are with me in the summer, like they sign up, they're with me for two straight months. Oh yeah. So for eight weeks, you know what I mean? Two times a week. So like, yeah. I know. Ah, uh, you had a baseball game yesterday. You were pitching. How'd you do? Yeah, you know what yeah, I mean? Yeah. So like, yo, this dude actually cares about these kids not just the paycheck right you know what right. i mean so that's when you get word of mouth because like you know parents want you to get their kids better but for a lot of it they just want you to like care exactly 